Hello guys and welcome to another Body Stenics tutorial. If you're new to our channel, be sure to start off by subscribing and hitting the bell icon for notifications so that way you don't miss any future videos just like this one. In today's tutorial, we're going to show you the top exercises to boost your plant strength from beginner to advanced level. The first exercise is the advanced straight bar support. For this exercise, we want to ensure that we begin in a solid support position with the scapula depressed. From there, our aim is to slightly pike at the hips and lift our body to where we are in a position away from the bar and hold for time. It's good to hold this position for at least 10 seconds, so that way we get into the habit of engaging the core and hollowing out our torso, which is transferable strength into the planche. The next exercise are the hip raises. Similarly to what we did with a support hold, now we want to do the same exercise for reps, with the only difference being that we want to slightly lift the hips higher until they are in line with our shoulders. We want to ensure to perform these reps in a controlled manner without rushing by emphasizing both the concentric and eccentric phases with utmost control. In addition, we want to focus on maintaining scapular protraction once we have lifted the hips and scapular depression whilst we are in the support position. The next exercise are the standing deficit push-ups. This variation of push-ups we're going to perform from a standing position so that way we are able to travel through a deficit range in order to condition our shoulders and prepare them to withstand the load of our entire body for planche. The key for this exercise is to achieve an increased range of motion in our push-up. Slightly release your pinky finger off the bar in order to gain that extra bit of range of motion. Once again, focus on a tightly compact hollow body and the maintenance of scapular protraction and forward shoulders, particularly in the bottom phase of the movement. The next exercise is a superset using the wide plank and the planche lean. Ensure that the focus for both of these exercises are the lockdown arms. This is a straight arm exercise which will combine biceps tendon strength building as well as shoulder strength building with the planche lean directly after. The key is to never sacrifice form for range. The next exercise are the L-sit to tuck planche holds. Hold each position for a minimum of three seconds and perform a total of four to six reps. Any transitional exercise with a tuck planche is super effective in building that time under tension, which is transferable strength for your chosen progression in any planche hold. Next, we have the L-sit to inverted pike reps performed on the equalizers. Ensure that we are keeping a 90 degree angle from our wrists, elbows and shoulders in every pike transition. This is effective in loading the shoulders and increasing time and attention, hence strengthening and preparing ourselves for our chosen planche progression. The final exercises are all straight arm handstand pressing exercises. The first is the straddle negative. Ensure that we try to perform this with our maximum straddle range as well as a super slow eccentric motion. Don't allow your shoulders to give in and lean forward because this is only going to lead towards broken form. The next variation is the tuck straight arm press. You can either begin this from the L sit or by directly standing on top of the parallettes and pressing in an upwards manner directly. Next, we have the straddle press variation. You can begin by placing your feet on top of the bars, straddling your feet out directly, and once again, resisting at the shoulders in order to maintain the stacked line of the handstand and press up successfully. And the final pressing variation is the full pike press, either from a standing or from L-sit positions. This variation is extremely challenging, so ensure that you have mastered one of the previous variations before trying this one. In order to see our previous planche tutorials on how to improve your form and engagement, as well as other planche combinations, be sure to click the card above and watch that tutorial today. Body Senex. Thanks for watching today's tutorial, guys. If you guys found value, then be sure to subscribe and also hit that bell icon for notifications. We upload a new tutorial every Wednesday and Saturday at 3 p.m. European Easter Summer Time. For those athletes who want a more in-depth approach to their calisthenics progress, be sure to get your own copy of the 100 Calisthenics Secrets book. And for an even more depth analysis on how you can progress as an all-round calisthenics athlete, be sure to get access to our exclusive Ultimate Calisthenics course.
And for those athletes who want to join the Body Bodysthenics global family of athletes who are taking their skills and strength to the next level, be sure to apply for online coaching today in order to fast track your progress and achieve elite calisthenics status. I'm George, Bodysthenics Coach. See you guys in the next video.